Hi, in this video I'm going to provide you with an important update to the Phuket Sandbox program. This program allows fully vaccinated travelers to enter Thailand without quarantine. Hi, how are you doing? If you are new to this channel, I'm George Chai Chai and you're on Mai Tai 24. Let's jump right into it and talk about the updates. The good news first, the Thai government finally gave green light to reopen Phuket to fully vaccinated international travelers starting on July 1st. However, some adjustments have been made to the Phuket Sandbox program. The biggest difference is that now fully vaccinated international travelers have to stay 14 days on Phuket, not only 7 days as initially planned, 14 days until they are free to travel elsewhere in Thailand. They say that this is because of the national policy that in all other provinces there is a 14 days quarantine for international travelers arriving in Thailand. If the nationwide quarantine will be later reduced to 7 days, then fully vaccinated international travelers will also only have to stay on Phuket for 7 days until they are free to travel elsewhere. I have adjusted my Phuket sandbox chart for you. Please have a look. Let's just go over it again. I will only emphasize the things which have changed. For all other details about the Phuket sandbox, Please watch my previous video, how to travel to Thailand without quarantine, how the Phuket sandbox works. Please check the link in the description. Okay, first you arrive in Phuket and according to the governor of the Tourism Authority of Thailand, they plan that you have to do a COVID-19 PCR test right after your arrival. If you have a negative test result, you will transfer to your hotel with a SHA approved bus or tour operator or with the pickup service of your hotel. Then you have to stay 14 days, as said, not only 7 days anymore, in a SHA plus certified hotel on Phuket, until you are allowed to travel to other provinces in Thailand. During these 14 day sandbox period, you are allowed to freely move around on Phuket, but are not allowed to make any day trips to destinations around Phuket as they initially have planned. Of course, you do not have to stay 14 days on Phuket if you do not want to. You can leave any time. But if you want to stay less than 14 days, you only can leave Phuket by leaving Thailand. For instance, by flying back home. Up to now, they plan that you have to do two more COVID-19 PCR tests. Namely on day 6 and day 12. But it is not 100% sure yet. Full details on this will be released soon. After the 14-day sandbox period, and negative results of your COVID-19 PCR tests, you are allowed to leave Phuket and go elsewhere in Thailand. If you test positive in any of the three COVID-19 tests, you have to quarantine in a hospital. A piece of good news is that you do not have to directly fly to Phuket anymore. But now they also have the option that you transit in Sawanapum Airport in Bangkok before flying to Phuket as part of the Sandbox program. There will be a dedicated terminal and a dedicated flight for these travelers. Something else has changed, namely the age of unvaccinated children who can enter Thailand without quarantine. First it was unvaccinated children under 12 years, but now it's under 6 years who can enter Thailand without quarantine if they travel with their vaccinated parents or guardians. They also don't have to do any testing. And unvaccinated children aged 6 to 18 years, used to be 12 to 18 years, now 6 to 18 years, can enter Thailand without quarantine too, but they have to get tested. They have to do a rapid anti-gene test at their own expense. So this might be interesting for people with children. Everything else with regard to the Phuket Sandbox program stays the same, just as I explained in my previous video about it. I'm talking about the video how to travel to Thailand without quarantine, how the Phuket Sandbox works. I will leave a link to it in the description. If you got value from this video, please hit the like button. Thank you. I have many more informative videos about Thailand coming up soon, so please subscribe and make sure that you don't miss them. Thank you very much for watching and I catch you on the next one.